Once upon a time, in a land far, far away, there lived a mischievous little creature named Wacky Wally. Hello, kids. This is Bella, your storyteller. Let me take you on an exciting journey filled with laughter and fun. Wacky Wally was a small, furry creature with big, googly eyes and a mischievous grin that could brighten anyone's day. He lived in a magical forest where trees whispered secrets and animals wore hats and bow ties. One sunny morning, Wacky Wally woke up with an idea bubbling in his mind. He wanted to throw the grandest tea party ever seen in the enchanted forest. With his trusty sidekick, Bumblebee the Talking Bee, by his side, they set out on a quest to invite all the forest creatures. Wally and Bumblebee hopped, skipped, and flew through the forest, calling out to the animals. They met Grumpy Gus, an old tortoise who loved to grumble. Why should I come to your silly tea party, grumbled Gus. Wally smiled and said, Because there'll be delicious honey sandwiches and magical singing birds, and you'll have lots of fun. Gus couldn't resist the thought of honey sandwiches and magical singing birds, so he agreed to come. Next, they bumped into Squiggly the Squirrel, who was always busy gathering acorns. I'm too busy to come to your party, chirped Squiggly. Wally winked and said, but we have acorn-shaped cookies and a nutty dance contest. It'll be so much fun. Squiggly couldn't resist the idea of acorn-shaped cookies and a nutty dance contest, so he agreed to come, too. As Wally and Bumblebee hopped along, they met Rosie the Rabbit, who was known for her nervousness. I'm too scared to come to your party, twitched Rosie. Wally chuckled and said, But we have carrot cake and a magic show with disappearing tricks. It'll be amazing. Rosie couldn't resist the thought of carrot cake and a magic show, so she agreed to come as well. Finally, Wacky Wally and Bumblebee had invited all the forest creatures. The day of the tea party arrived, and the enchanted forest was buzzing with excitement. Wally had decorated the clearing with colorful balloons and flowers, creating a magical atmosphere. As the animals arrived, they were amazed by the delicious treats and enchanting entertainment. Grumpy Gus couldn't help but tap his feet to the rhythm of the magical singing birds. Squiggly the squirrel showed off his best dance moves, impressing everyone with his nutty skills. And Rosie the rabbit forgot all her worries as she watched the mesmerizing magic show. Wacky Wally beamed with joy as he saw his friends laughing, dancing, and having a wonderful time. It was a tea party to remember. As the sun set over the magical forest, the animals bid goodbye each with a heart full of joy and a promise to meet again soon. Wacky Wally and Bumblebee waved goodbye, grateful for the incredible adventure they had shared. And so, kids, the adventures of Wacky Wally came to an end for today. But remember, there's always magic waiting to be discovered, even in the smallest of creatures. I hope you enjoyed our story. Good night. Sleep tight and have sweet dreams. <laughs>